Hello everybody, it's Cobblers Vlogs and welcome back to another video where today we are previewing tomorrow afternoon's game between Northampton Town and Grimsby Town. Can the Cobblers go, I think it's seven unbeaten. It's going to be interesting, let's find out. Let's get into this match preview. So as normal, we're going to get started by looking at the recent form, uh, starting with the league positions. The Cobblers are sat in 7th, having played 18 games, winning 8, drawing 4, losing 6 on 28 points. Notably, 2 points off 3rd place Bradford in the automatic promotion places. Grimsby Town, they sit down in 18th, uh, having played uh, 3 less games, actually they've played 15. They've won 5, drawn 4 and lost 6. So... You know, 11 places separating the sides of the table. Hopefully the Cobblers can make that show. Looking at Grimsby's uh, results, been a bit topsy-turvy recently uh, in terms of November. Uh, they played on Wednesday night against Newport. That was in the FA Cup first round replay. And it was a 2-0 defeat for them. Before that, uh, their game against Newport in the league was postponed. Uh, before that, it was a 1-1 draw. So uh, going back to the last time they actually played in the league, uh, well, that was October the 22nd where they drew nil nil to Cambridge so exactly a month uh, since they've played in the league they had a game against Plymouth postponed and obviously they've had the FA Cup games and a couple of games postponed as well uh, due to bad weather so I had quite a few cancellations Grimsby and have not played in the league since Tuesday October the 22nd and that was a nil nil draw against Cambridge so they're not in great form they're a bit mismatched at the minute they've obviously just sacked their manager Michael Jolly I think it was who was in charge of them uh, he's been sacked so a real opportunity for the Cobblers to grab three points, but they have struggled the Cobblers against teams lower down than them this season. Looking at the Cobblers then, in terms of our last three results, obviously we're sat in seventh, just two points off the automatic promotion places. Last weekend, it was that emphatic 4-1 win against Crew Alexandra. Uh, obviously, Crew coming out with all sorts of excuses for losing that one. Before that, it was an FA Cup first round walkover. Uh, it was Ch Chippenham Town nil, Northampton Town free in that one. And then before that, on Saturday the 2nd of November, it was a 2-2 draw against Oldham, us being 2-0 up in that game and letting it slip. So we are undefeated, and I think it's six now, I think if we, uh, or seven if we win this one or fail to, uh, fail to lose. Um, so yeah, good form for the Cobblers. Hopefully they can keep this run going and get into those automatic promotion places with a win. So look at the Danger Men, Cobblers fans, you're already aware of this. The likes of Sam Hoskins who are performing well in recent weeks. Alan McCormack has been absolutely massive uh, for the Cobblers recently as well in that midfield role. There's also the likes of Smith and uh, Williams who are scoring goals up front. Verdane Oliver has shown that he can be a Danger Man. Charlie Goode at the back is in fantastic form with Jordan Turnbull and Scott Wharton as well who shout out to him for getting an inform into the FIFA team of the week. Yes, I've already bought his card. Uh, why haven't you? Um, looking at Grimsby, just looking at their squad. Well, the likes of James Hansen are there, a uh, well-known League Two player, obviously sort of haunted the Cobblers a few years ago uh, with Bradford at Wembley. Uh, the likes of Matt Green up front as well, Charles Vernon, Akeem Rose, some decent players, Grimsby. We've got Elliot Hewitt, uh, the number 11, Jordan Cook as well, Elliot Whitehouse, all of those can cause problems. Uh, so those are the ones to look out for in terms of the danger men for the Mariners. So let's quickly look at the head-to-head -head before we get into the score predictions. Uh, the teams have played each other 38 times. Uh, the Cobblers have won 16 of those. They've drawn nine and Grimsby have lost 13. Um, so the Cobblers have lost 13, Grimsby have won 13. Um, so the first ever game between the Suicides, for just for a bit of context, was in the 9th of January 1915, uh, where the Cobblers came out 3-0 winners in the FA Cup, but that's completely irrelevant. Um, the last time the Suicides met was on the 16th of March 2019, uh, that was a 0-0 draw, and you'll remember the game at Sixfields last year was quite a dramatic one, uh, that was a 2-2 draw. Uh, the last time the Cobblers beat Grimsby was on my birthday actually. Uh, the 2nd of April 2010, where they won 2 1 away, um, but they haven't beaten Grimsby uh, since that date, 2010. So hopefully we can do that tomorrow. Uh, my score prediction is going to be 3 0 to the Cobblers. Hopefully we can get the win. Drop a like if you've enjoyed this video and if you're excited about what's to come with this Cobblers team in the future. So yeah, drop a like if you've enjoyed it. Hit the subscribe button if you're new around here. Really would appreciate it. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye bye.